Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Vlogmas. I don't even know what day we're on, but we're just gonna welcome. we're just gonna be back. Okay. So today is Saturday. It is exactly three days before my first final. So I just completed this very last week of classes, school, done with health assessment. Hated that class, but it is what it is. Um, if you watched my last like OSCE video, like that, just go watch it. I'll leave it up here. But anyways, um, so just got done with my last week of school this past week. So right now, I am just studying for patho. So um, we ended up having both of our classes in the same day or both of our lectures in the same day so we didn't have to go like on thursday so last night i was up until three o'clock in the morning and i just went over all of that material i re-listened to all my lecture so there's a couple of things in the book that i actually want to like look at but of course that final is not until thursday so after my patho final is when i'm going to decide to actually like read um, the book and just really like dive into those topics a little bit more um, deeply thoroughly something so anyways the plan oh shit sorry I was making some breakfast the plan for today is really just studying for patho um, I don't really know because I just feel like I've been studying for a week and a half straight and there's a lot of information that I do, you know, remember. But I also feel like I'm slick not, like, retaining anything. I say that, but I'm like, I just need, like, somebody to quiz me. I need, like, somebody to quiz me, ask me questions, and just see if I'm actually, like, comprehending anything. Um, it's just a lot of material. It's a lot of material and a lot of PowerPoint to get through, and I think that's what it is. It's just so much material. I have managed to read all the PowerPoints. I really wanted to go through all of my flashcards, which I still will, but it's a lot of flashcards. It's like we're talking about almost a th over a thousand flashcards that I made over this last semester, over this past this semester. Yeah, I know I look rough as fuck. But, oh, so yesterday, a little tip here. Yesterday I made some shea butter. Uh, I talked about this in a few vlogs ago. Um, that I was going to make some shea butter for my hair, like body and hair shea butter. So I made some yesterday. That shit is bomb as fuck, and I cannot wait to make some. So I'll insert some clips here just to show you, like, how I made my shea butter. Yeah, so I made some shea butter. It's bomb as fuck. I used it last night, and, like, my skin still feels, like, super moisturized. I really wanted to use it really for my hair um, because, as you know, I'm about to be doing my twist this week, and then I really wanted something just really, like, natural for my daughter um because i noticed that since she has been like crawling on the floor her like elbows have um had like rough patches i don't really think necessarily they're eczema because it's really only on her elbows but i want to start using like i already kind of use a lot of natural products for her anyway but this is something that was a super easy and then once i like start you know dibble dabbling in it a little bit more um i'll definitely try to find some cost effective ways to make my shea butter but yeah it's a whole lot of fun and i can't wait to keep making it <laughs> done with cardiac there's like so many chapters with cardiac so i'm like really trying to get through it and make sure i understand everything 
Um, so I'm working on congenital and I have one more which is just um, abnormal EKGs or abnormal cardiac conduction. conduction. Um, but from here on out it really should be smooth sailing because everything else is like three chapters each from each exam so it really shouldn't take me that long. Let's keep our fingers crossed. But it's four o'clock. I just got done ordering my groceries so I'm actually making vegan chili tonight. I'm going to make vegan chili for Brooklyn and I, and then I'll make just regular chili for my husband. It's really the same thing. I'm just making different meats. Um, and then I'm actually going to have some crescent rolls, and I'm going to make some apple, what is it, apple crescent rolls? So there's like an apple pie version, but in a crescent roll. All right, so excuse my unkept, unclean house. But I am currently just prepping for dinner today. So I went ahead and chopped up at least half of an onion. I may add more, but I think this might be okay. Currently right now, I just have some vegan butter in the pot. It's getting hot. And then, the reason I'm making chili is because A, it's good as fuck, and two, I need to get rid of like some stuff that's in my freezer that I've had forever and I'm just like, I need to get rid of it. So I have like some peppers, some corn, just like, you know how like you need to clean out your fridge, you've had stuff in there, or your freezer and you've had stuff in there and you just kind of like forget about it? Well, I'm sick of it being there, so I'm going to go ahead and just chop some bell peppers. I have frozen bell peppers in here. I will probably actually use these. Um, I actually have two things of bell peppers, but I'll probably use the majority of them when I make my breakfast in the mornings now that I know I have them. So I'm going to go ahead and toss my onions in here. So I went ahead and just got started my pot ready. So as you saw, I put the vegan butter. I went ahead and put the onions and the green peppers in there and let them saute. I went ahead and had my seasoning. So the following seasons is what I use for the entire pot. Paprika, chili powder, garlic powder, Himalayan salt, black pepper. I also might have added some cayenne pepper and some Italian seasoning and cumin. So I use that throughout the um, entire process of me making the chili. I also added a little bit of vegetable stock. And then I also added um, black beans, spicy, which weren't really spicy, and just regular black beans. And then once my groceries get here, I start adding um, some more things. So I went ahead and just sauteed that and let that um, kind of simmer on low until my groceries got here. And I also added some garlic, as you can see. And that was like the beginning stages of the chili. I'm going to get started on the dessert. They're like vegan apple pie croissants. So I went ahead and took some apples that I had and just peeled them and decored them. I went ahead and just chopped them up, not into like very fine pieces, but just like bite-sized pieces. And I'm just gonna wash them and then I'm gonna dry them off and toss them in some brown sugar, cinnamon, and nutmeg. Because the delivery of my food was taking a while, I went ahead and just popped that mixture into the freezer. I didn't want like everything to start like mixing or melting together. So I finally got my groceries. Literally took too long, but the lady was so nice. Like she was nice. I didn't So I'm getting started on my dessert. So I, there's eight total in the pack. So I took four and of course made regular just crescent rolls. And then I took the other four and that's where I get started on making the dessert. So I break all four pieces apart and I should have stretched them out but I'll definitely do it differently next time. I went ahead and buttered them up with some vegan butter and then I that's when I go ahead and I place all of them making sure that I use all of my apples 
and I just went ahead and whatever was like the drippings that were left I went ahead and just kind of put that in as well and I just went ahead and tossed them and rolled them up I added some butter on top and I think I may have sprinkled it a little bit with some cinnamon sugar and brown yeah so I just took whatever was left and just put it on top I actually let these bake for about 15 to 20 minutes um, I wanted them to be like really done and that's what they're looking like Your girl is tired. Actually, I'm not like sleepy sleepy. I'm just like winded. Like, wow, I just did a lot. Does that make sense? Because I actually don't really feel sleepy in a sense. I'm like, okay, I feel good. I got a lot of energy or whatever. But I'm just like, dang, I just did a lot of shit. Does that make sense? Anyways, so I just wiped down the counters, made my dessert, working on the chili. So I seasoned the hell out of this shit. So I bought like chili seasoning, but that shit was whack. So what I did was I added cumin, paprika, garlic powder, chili powder. And I mean like, what I meant like chili powder, I mean chili powder in the pack. Um, I actually just have chili powder. And Himalayan salt and pepper. And I just kind of seasoned it until, you know, my ancestors told me that it's enough so I can't really give you the measurements just taste and season as you go so you feel like it's this is well seasoned but don't over season feel me all right so vegan chili is popping okay so there's corn there's dark kidney beans the black beans that you saw and these spicy black beans which aren't spicy but and then i added like a dash of cayenne pepper in both pots both pops has the same ingredients just this one has vegan meat uh, this one has vegan meat and the other one has actual meat for my husband and i added some rotel diced tomatoes with some chiles and there's a little bit of jalapeno peppers in here and diced, but it's not spicy at all. And then this is my husband's pot. I didn't realize it was so big to be honest, but I really don't think it's that big. I think it may be like the same size, which I think. That's his pot. I'm actually gonna let his pot just stay on low until he gets home. He should probably be home. I think he gets off at eight. It's currently 8.08 .08 right now. All right, so. Hey y'all, it is about 10 o'clock. Dinner was bomb. It was good. Chili was amazing. Um, I ended up, after the last clip, I actually ended up adding a can of Rotel. And perfect. Alright y'all, so it is 1 o'clock in the morning. I don't really remember where I left off at. Um, I think I was just telling y'all that the dessert was really good. Um, I think the only thing that I would change is oh, maybe like um, covering the whole dessert with dough. I will make it um, again maybe tomorrow or in a few days um, and just improve it. But it actually is really good. I highly recommend it. Um, chili was good. Um, husband loved it. Anyways, it is 1 o'clock in the morning and I'm still studying. Right now I'm at Reno. Reno between Reno and Liver. Um, I'm actually done. I was just kind of reading in the book to um, solidify some information. That I was like, it wasn't clear on the PowerPoint. Um, I'm actually gonna move into pediatrics next. But that is really it for this vlog. I know. Hopefully, it was a good vlog. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna edit this vlog tomorrow because I actually have two vlogs. I need to edit and that's it so plan for today my husband's off today so I'm actually just keep my fingers crossed that he can like watch her keep her entertained so I can get a lot of studying done because it's like gonna be my last really full day of studying and I really need to just lock everything down for sure tomorrow because monday is just me and her and then tuesday's my exam so comment down below wish me good luck this by the time this video goes up 
I would be, I would have already had my exam. I would either would have already had my exam or I would be studying for my next final, final number two. So definitely comment down below. Give me good luck. Wish me well. I will make a full video regarding like my year or my semester and my thoughts and all of that. So you'll find out how I did. But thank you so much for the support. I have enjoyed reading all of your comments during Vlogmas. And yeah. I can't wait to like film more like sit down videos throughout this like break and I have a lot of good things in store so I'm super excited but thank you so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I will talk to y'all tomorrow and comment this emoji right here if you made it to the end of the video and yeah bye y'all